I took a big risk to snatch prey from the nest. The reward needs to be better than that. <laughs> you sure this is right? I'm dripped down safe. The inhibitor should have taken effect by now. I'll wait a little longer. Huh. <laughs> Just my luck. Car broke down all the way out here. Not a soul to be seen. Just an abandoned yard. Hurry up and send someone over. You're awake. Guess you're a tough gal. But I'm warning you. Don't try any tricks on me, you hear? So you're just a middleman? You working for people from the N109 zone? Shut up. Let me inspect the goods before I hand you over. Where did you hide the ether core? Kidnapping Anakinus' prey without letting us know. That's not exactly polite. <laughs> Who's there? Anakinus. She's ours, by the way. We called dibs a long time ago. <laughs> that was fast. I'm really curious. She's brave enough to drink from a flat glass. What will she do when backed into a corner? You're pretty bold for releasing information about the ether core in the nest like that. Explains why Boss is interested. <laughs> I see. Silas sent you. But the Ether Core is mine. But the Ether Core is mine. <clears throat> Take out the vermin that are still running amok. Yes, sir. So, he is the head of Onakinus. If this information is leaked, you might become Onakinus's next target. <laughs> You're also here for the core, right? Even if you wanted to sell your soul, you still have to find someone who can pay the price. This voice... I've heard it somewhere before. <gasps> Look at me. You... Possess him. Devour, Devour him. him. Do that, Do that and, you and you will gain, gain the power you have always, always dreamed of. of. It hurts. This power... It's yours for the taking. Just... Kill him. I can't look into his eyes. Is this how you greet a new friend? Uh, I guess you don't remember anything. Allow me to jog your memory. Like From your past, me. to your future, to even all the crimes you'll inevitably commit. After all, you and I, we're the 
sang true kindred spirit. Three days, you were still unable to achieve even a simple resonance. How disappointing. What? What do you want? You went through all that trouble to enter the N109 zone. I must fulfill my duty as your host. Stop! Devour him. He is yours. He is right there before your very eyes. It's a shame your evil has deteriorated into its current state. Crocodile tears. My family's deaths. You're behind them, right? <laughs> Family? The people closest to you might be the ones who want to kill you the most. Shut up! Spoilers. Right now? I just... I just want to you kill you myself! You will help you in a fight against me. Your courage is admirable. You're lucky I don't like picking on the weak, kitten. What are you doing? Hmm? Didn't you want to take my life, or do your words just ring hollow? Kill him. Kill him. Kill. You think I won't do it? Now... That's much better. Though you do owe me a curtain call grander than death itself. Uh, I... Why are you trembling? Has your resolve already begun to falter? <laughs> you weren't just bluffing, were you? Of course not. It's just... Some help? Yes, no, maybe so. No. She won't be sleeping forever, right? She's been unconscious for one day. We need to wake her up. Easy. Just open up the back of her head, drill a hole in her neck, and... <laughs> You're seeing things. I'm the only one here. There is no two. My soul can leave my body. Are you stunned? Shocked? Boring. <clears throat> Hi. Before you left boss's parlor, well, we already met. Four days ago, to be exact. We didn't just save you from that ungrateful traitor. We also brought you back to Onikinus' base. You crazy? 
You wanted to take my life, and so you've taken it. <gasps> now what? Have you already figured out how you'll pay me back? No, you can't die yet. <laughs> Why? Are you worried about me? Save that for the day. You actually succeed in killing me. We know what you're thinking. But after being hunted down in the nest, do you know how many people are out there looking for you? And even if you escape, you'll only get lost in the chaos of this no man's land. Wanders will eat you up. They also won't leave behind any crumbs, so... Stay, stay here, here with, with our, our boss. boss. Throw away all morality and compassion, and this place will be a paradise. Take a guess. What are you doing? Why are you staring at me? Did I say you weren't allowed to leave? Okay, just go straight down the hall and you'll see the exit. Really? That's very nice of you to just give away a hunter's secret weapon! You... How far do you think she'll get? 30 meters? I bet not even 10 steps. <laughs> I'll say five then.
This will be useful for defending yourself in the N109 zone. I'm giving you a way out. Since you can't escape, why don't we make a deal? As long as you have desires, there will always be deals to make. So many days have come and gone. You should know your own desires by now. Only I can give you what you want. And you will agree to my terms. Release me. You can't do that just yet. Maybe I've been too nice to you. After all that arrogance, it seems like you can't even control your own evil. Just as I thought. You're too weak. Eat as much as you want. I'll give you ten minutes. After you're done, come find me outside the base's entrance. You better hope our deal is successful. Otherwise, consider this your last meal. Ugh. I must have been really drunk to make a deal with this monster. going to experience the sights and sounds of the N109 zone? Do you have nine lives? Curiosity killed the cat. Then I shouldn't go. <sighs> you like to bargain, don't you? But you're not yet qualified. Ugh, are there no speed limits in the end of the zone? I still don't know where the auction will take place. If you want to stay out of trouble, behave yourself inside. And if I refuse? 
hurts. You'll hurt even more. <laughs> Who is it? If you want to order something, bring your own protocol. I won't accept anything that isn't high grade. Mr. Silas, you don't usually do surprise visits. I got you a guinea pig. It's time for your Evol linkage alteration project to have a living test subject. Wait. You want to alter me? In that case, let me take a look first. <sighs> Sir, you're not actually going to alter me, right? I'm just a normal evolver. <sighs> Trying to bargain with me is pointless. No one can change Silas's mind. You have the resonance evil? <sighs> Did they do anything while I was gone? Nothing too dramatic, just two explosions. One in the northern suburbs and one in the Bloomshore District. Bloomshore District? This is related to Grandma. They just made a bunch of shoddy products. I overestimated them. <sighs> and after doing those shameless things and making a mess, then they want you to be their scapegoat. What are you talking about? Someone else made those two explosions happen? Oh dear, you look disappointed. <sighs> <sighs> Instead of searching for the truth, you'd rather swallow a lie that makes you feel better. <sighs> I'm afraid she's not a suitable recipient. Her evil linkage is completely normal. Only the strength's been suppressed. Did someone put in a suppressor? I don't think it's physical. It's not my fault. I can resonate just fine with others. And that thing I asked you to alter, how's that? It was difficult, but the maximum energy burst value has been increased tenfold. Are you really going to use it? She's oppressed, right? She just needs a little stimulation then. Are you scared? You should step back. Resonate. It's not too late to back out now. Look out! Let's settle this in one fell swoop. I guess it's gonna fight dirty. Silent! It can't escape. Good fight. I'll turn her energy linkage now. Make it as strong as possible. This isn't what we agreed to. <laughs> Relax. You can handle it. <clears throat> Mr. Silas, I think there's another reason why she can't resonate. You see, her evol is special. It utilizes the waves generated by the human brain's magnetic field. Maybe her brain's magnetic field produces repulsive waves against you. That's why she can't resonate with you. 
Get to the point. To make a long story short, on a subconscious level, she's either rejecting you, scared of you, or, uh, disgusted by you. Even if she undergoes alteration, you won't be able to resonate with her so long as she's still hostile toward you. And Mr. Silas, if the alteration fails, she will be completely ruined. We need to address the cause first. Which means there's something wrong with her. You let go of me! By the way, I have an Evol stabilizer in the storage cabinet. I'll make her use it. <laughs> right now, you need to stay calm, miss. The N109 zone is a chaotic place, and you have a part of an ether core. Accompanying him is the safest option. I recognize that proto curve. Monitoring ether cores used to be my job. The N109 zone is a mess right now. An outsider like you who's Unfamiliar with the details can easily lose her life. Sticking with Silas might not be a bad idea. Better to be with him compared to some other people. <sighs> You're just not used to the darkness yet. There are predators lurking in these depths that you haven't seen. You say Silas is heartless, but sometimes those with hearts are even crueler than those without. All right, there's nothing wrong with your evil. The energy of the ether core inside you is also stable. Have you figured out what you'll do next? Well, if all goes well for you and whatever happens, then I can say I've repaid Miss Josephine's kindness. Would you like to buy a flower, miss? Would you like a gun, bullets, or a protocor then? I have them all. <laughs> That's easy. Follow me. <laughs> <laughs> 